Hey y'all, it's me, Slay by Jordan. And do not mind my shirt. I just ate a seafood boil before this video. Do not mind me. But today this wig will be provided by Lou Hair. Inside the box, you get an edge comb. You get a wig grip. You get their thank you card. You get a wig cap, two wig caps, an elastic band, and of course your wig. The name of this wig is Tina. It is a kinky straight full lace wig, medium cap size, 120% density, and it's also 20 inches. The wig does come pre-plucked, and as I said again, it is a full lace wig, so it is lace all over. There is no tracks on this wig. And now after being braided down, we're going to secure her stocking cap. We're going to sew it around the sides and the back. And then we're going to take our got to be glue, ultra glue gel in the black bottle. And we're going to secure the cap around the whole circumference. And that is my coworker, Kilo. She's a braider. <laughs> She's video bumming me, but I don't mind. As you can see now, I'm cutting out the ear tabs. And we're gonna finish securing that cap with some free spray and then she'll go up on the dryer for 15 to 20 minutes on high. She is now back from the dryer and we're going to cut off her excess cap using our shears and then we're going to take our Maybelline Fit Me foundation in a brush and we're going to make that cap blend in with her skin.
if you watch my blonde patch closure week video you will know my client here jayla is allergic to alcohol so today we'll be cleaning the skin using the rc breeze and then our boho skin protect Off camera in the front, I did bleach the knots and also plucked the hairline a little bit just to give it a more natural look. And now you're going to get your client to help you hold the wig in place and you're going to position everything exactly where you want it to be. And now we're going to take our boho active three layers today we're going to dot it along that cap and then we're going to spread it out using our popsicle stick and we're going to wait until everything turns clear And now you're going to lay that lace right on down in place and you're going to use the back of your cones to help you smooth it down. And then you're going to take a blow dryer on cool and just make sure everything is secure. And now we're going to go ahead and cut off that excess lace in the back and get it prepared to be glued down. Now, FYI, if you want a more natural look in the back, you can also bleach the knots in the back and pluck it as well. But I decided not to in this video, but you most definitely can.
and we're going to do three layers along the sides and the back as we did in the front and we're going to wait till it turns clear. And now we're going to lay that lace down on the sides of the back. Make sure your client is bending their hair forward so the wig doesn't pop out of place. And now we're going to tie everything down using our JoJo Blue Silk Wraps, which you can purchase on my website, www.slaydaycollection.com. And she will go up under a dryer on medium for about 15 to 20 minutes. And before she goes up on the dryer, we're going to take our Tresemme Heat Protecting Spray, Keratin Smooth, and we're going to spray it all over the hair, and then we're going to blow dry it using our comb attachment on high just to smooth it out before we style it. And now we're going to carefully cut that lace off using our eyebrow razor. Come through, Lace. Come through. And now for the back, we're going to use our shears. We're just going to cut off all the excess lace that didn't get secured down with the glue. And we're just going to make sure everything is secured in place.
look at how natural that wig looks. Now I'm going to show you the wig in a ponytail and also in a bun just to show you some styling options you have with this wig. You can also part this wig anywhere. You can part it all the way down the middle. You can part it across the head. You have full control with a full lace wig. And now I'm going to take my hot comb, we're going to go ahead and we're going to set that part into place. And although we do not need them, my client loves baby hairs, so we're going to give her some baby hairs. I'm going to cut them down using my eyebrow razor. And to slip them down, I'll be using my She Is Bomb Collection Bum Goo.
Somebody is feeling themselves. Now we're gonna take our Fantasia Frizz Buster and we're gonna put this all over the hair and we're gonna to proceed to press this hair bone straight.
I love how this hair mimics African American texture hair, but it also can get bone straight. So much versatility. And now we're going to take our Beyond the Zone turn up the heat spray to give the hair a beautiful gloss. Make sure you use my coupon code LUHAIR10 for 10% off your purchase. This is for a limited time only. And don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. And turn on your notification bell. I have more uploads coming this week. Thank you so much for 25k. I appreciate and love all the support. Thank you. Goodbye.